And here are the Phillies for that eighth race. Number one, Suncoast, owned by the Suncoast stable of Lexington. John Dewar trains. Steve Waller drives. Two is always victorious. Owned by the all La Nuevas Bar of Pompano Beach, Florida, Mario Zuanetti, the trainer driver. Three, my start chip, owned by Plum Creek Farms of Lebanon, New Jersey, by Bill Peretti of Cream Ridge, New Jersey. Chuck Sylvester trains, and John Campbell gets a call. Four, Georgia Pines, owned by Crimson Lane of Anderson, Indiana. Ross Turley, the trainer, Dave McGee, up. Five, Pan on Ceremony, owned by Peter Pan Stables, Inc. of Pepper Pike, Ohio. Ivan Sugg, the trainer, with Tony Morgan. Six, Spice on Ice, owned by Scuderia Gardasina of uh, Italy. John Johnson trains and drives. Seven, Hottest Star, owned by Tom Crouch of, Lexing of Lexington. Brian Pinsky of Downers Grove, Illinois. Pinsky trains with Andy Miller in the bike. And number eight, Glide Path, owned by Brittany Farms of Versailles, Kentucky. Ron Gerfine, the trainer. Mike Lachance, the driver. Third division of the Hayes Memorial, field of eight fillies. At the post... Gates rolling. Here they come. They're off and trotting from the outside. There goes Spice on Ice for the lead on the inside. Suncoast will get away second. Third is always victorious. Out fourth as they drive toward the uh, turn is my star chip to the inside. Trotting five, Georgia Pines as they race around the turn. Extreme outside, three wide now, trying to move up as they race that way is Glide Path. Glide Path as they uh, go toward the quarter. Suncoast is off stride. Glide Path is on the move. And the leader getting away from the, the field now by five lengths at the quarter mile mark. Trotting past it is Spice on Ice. She'll lead him down the back stretch. Front panel and 29 flat on the extreme outside. Continuing her drive toward the front. There goes Glide Path and Lachance. Now second on the inside. Trotting third as they straighten down the back stretch. And trot toward the half mile mark is My Starship. Racing fourth behind her. As they drive that way, as always, victorious, trotting five, Georgia Pines, racing six is Pan on Ceremony, trotting next is Hottest Star, and at the back, after a break, is Suncoast. Field approaching the half-mile mark, the leader as they reach that station, and now trot past it toward the upper turn, and uh, race now into the upper turn by a length and a half glide path. Behind glide path, Spice on Ice gets a trip second. The half was trotted in 58-2. They're headed toward the three-quarter. Glide path maintains the advantage off the rail to the outside. Here comes My Starship moving up for Campbell. She's now second, racing toward the front. On the inside, glide path, and here comes My Starship full of trot. And back to the outside from the inside, moving up also as always victorious. They're at the three-quarter. They race past that mark in 127-2. They're at the top of the lane. This could be a season's record. And the new leaders, they turn for home as my Starship, they're three wide behind her, far outside, always victorious is moving, and also Spice on Ice moves up as they race through the lane to the wire, My Starship might have a season's mark, closing on the outside is always victorious, as they head this way, drawing away My Starship, and Campbell has that filly rolling to the wire, on the outside, always victorious is second, trotting third, Spice on Ice, four at the wire, was Georgia Pines, 157-1, it is a national season's record. It is my star chip. My star chip, 157-1, John Campbell. Always victorious unofficially was two. Spice on Ice 3 with the late closing Georgia Pines 4.
driven by the leading money-winning driver in the sport of harness racing by Hall of Famer, 100 million plus winner, John Campbell. Here's the fastest trotting two-year-old filly in North America to date. Owned by Plum Creek Farms of Lebanon, New Jersey, by Bill Peretti of Cream Ridge, New Jersey, Chuck Sylvester trains John Campbell, the winning driver, my star chip. Winning filly by the exported pine chip, who trotted to the 151 world race record for trotters. Stood his career here in this country at Castle and Farm. Upon their dispersal last fall, he was exported to Scandinavia. And leaves quite a crop of two-year-olds. In fact, in this race, they were 1-3-4. The Mr. Vic Philly, always victorious, breaking that lock by Pine Chip Phillies. And the winner and season's champion now oh, is uh, My Star Chip, the Pine Chip from My Starlet by Joie de Vie.